Hi everybody, it's me, uh, another one on the Pentabender, five hole per octave tuning. It's very similar to the four hole per octave tuning that I now call Power Chromatic because Brendan Power lays claim to it. That's a four six five six tuning. So it's in that key. No tonic chord, just a four and a five. You can hear how similar it is. But there's an added hole, so every note can be played with a draw band. All 12 keys, and all 12 notes of the chromatic scale. so on. The reason I'm making this video is because in response to a thread about a tuning called Easy Third. The thing about Easy Third is you're eliminating a bunch of notes of the major scale that you might want to have. So here's uh, e Wayfaring Stranger on a, a Pentabender. I'm using the blow mode. So it's that key. I'm playing the draw note because then you get the expression. But then I'm going to blow. Because that's where the pentatonic is. A lot of songs are pentatonic. If you listen to modern pop music, a lot of the melodies are very pentatonic. So you can put all the color notes in that you can't necessarily do in some other strictly chordal tuning where all the chromatic notes are not available. Uh, of course you have to know where the notes are and I don't practice this tuning enough to know where they all are. So you'll hear little clams, but you kind of get the idea. The D note, hope that's D, it sure is, it can be played as a blow or a draw. The draw note can be bent down a half step. And the A note. Same thing. And this is true in every octave. This is a five hole per octave tuning, and the tuning is the same in every octave. You really got to make your mouth wide, shove it back in there to do that. And because it's all blow or draw, you have to. Well, because the pentatonics are all blow or draw, you have to think about your breathing. Like, I didn't breathe properly before I started that passage, and I ran out of air rather quickly. Um, I could try to do Ghost Riders, which was the other tune that Greg played in his demo, but I'm not gonna. You get the idea. Uh, this is fully chromatic, and it's pentatonic. two pentatonics. One is uh, F or D minor. And one is G or E minor. If you just stick with the one plane, you're not going to play any wrong notes. You're also going to tank up. Or use up all your air breathing out. Now that's it. Just another rah-rah video for the Pentabender. I think it's useful. If I ever learn to play it properly, look out world. Bye.